All right, guys, welcome back to another video of the iPhone 12 Pro Max. And these are going to be the five accessories that I highly recommend for you. Majority of these are the ones that you can use. I think there's one that is not be able to be used by everybody. So let's get started. And if you are new, make sure you subscribe by hitting the red button down below, which is subscribe button and make sure you hit the bell icon. It really helps the channel grow. So let's start off with number one, which is this right here, the iPhone 12 Pro Max silicone case. I've actually done a video for this case and I'll leave a link for the video down in the description down below as well as on the top right hand corner for you to check out afterwards. And it's a little bit in depth than what I'm going to talk about today. Um, this is going to be my number one accessory that I highly recommend for the 12 Pro Max. It's a silicone case. I do like that this case is a little bit better than the leather case. It has a little bit more of a grip for when you're taking your phone out of your pocket. Now both cases are going to be compatible with that brand new feature for all the iPhones, which is a MagSafe. So all your MagSafe accessories will be compatible with this case. This case retails for $49 on the US side, $69 on the Canadian side. And once again, I'll be leaving a link for all of those prices down below and a link for these cases as well. Now my number two accessory is the USB-C power adapter. Now, I think many people do have this particular adapter. So if you have bought the last year's iPhone 11 Pro Max, not the iPhone 11, you would have received this charger in the actual box. Um, you didn't have to pay anything extra. But this year, Apple has not included this particular charger in the box. So I highly do recommend this charger because it's one of those um, accessories that you don't know when you need it. I do leave it at my house because I'm usually working from home. And if I am going out at the last minute, I always do plug in my phone to this particular power adapter because it charges a little bit faster than when my phone's connected to my laptop or even the MagSafe charger. So the MagSafe charger um, goes for 15 watts. This goes for 20 watts. Now this does retail for $19 on the US side, $25 on the Canadian side. Now the third thing is I personally love enjoying a nice podcast. Uh, nice music album or even watching YouTube videos whenever I am outside and if you have any good recommendations for certain albums or podcasts let me know in the comment section down below I'll be sure to check that out in order for me to enjoy my Apple TV as well as all those things I, I recommend the AirPods Pro um, these are a little bit costly but they're absolutely phenomenal with not only the connectivity towards my iPhone as well as MacBook Pro, but the fact that these have the spatial audio, which is a game changer when you're watching content on Apple TV at the moment. And I'm sure it's gonna to transition towards the music as well as other platforms. But overall, these are really nice. I highly recommend this. Um, the review is still being worked on for these AirPods Pros. They're one of the best accessories that I have purchased for not only my iPhone, but also for my MacBook Pro. The recent update to Big Sur has really smoothed the transition when I'm using my iPhone and going towards my MacBook Pro. These do transition quite fast and I'm able to take my calls on my iPhone and then move it towards my MacBook Pro. I haven't had any issues in terms of, you know, the AirPods being disconnected. The battery life is decent for these AirPods and um, they retail for $249 on the US side and $329 on the Canadian side. The fourth thing that I recommend um, if you have purchased any of the iPhone 12 series, it doesn't have to be the Pro Max or the Pro, any of the iPhone 12 series comes standard with the MagSafe charging capability. So for that reason, I recommend the MagSafe charger. Now this is a wireless puck. Now I actually haven't opened this. I was actually gonna wait for this video. So let's quickly open this and designed by Apple in California. And inside you have the actual MagSafe. Let's take it out. Comes with the USB-C cable. And this puck right here is basically a Qi enabled um, puck, which attaches to your iPhone 12 Pro really easily like that. And then once it clicks in, it's very, very hard for your iPhone to slide off and it's very magnetic. So it has that nice clunk and you're able to charge your iPhone 12, 12 Pro Max, uh, 12 Pro at a much higher speed than your traditional wireless chargers. Now keep that in mind if you're comparing the wireless charging capabilities to the 20 watt charger, it is going to be a little bit slower, but not that noticeable. So Apple is claiming 15 watts of charging capability with this charger when you connect it 
to the power brick and it is going to be a little bit faster charging than other Qi wireless chargers. All right, so finally for the fifth and highly recommended accessory for the 12 series, it doesn't have to be the 12 Pro Max. It could be any iPhone 12 series and I'm highly recommending this because I've been using this for close to a month now and I absolutely love it. I wasn't really going to recommend this previously because I wasn't sure how it was going to be until I've actually used it, but it's going to be the Belkin Car Vent Mount Pro. Now, I am working on a review video for this particular mount. Let me know in the comment section down below what you would like to know about this particular mount. I would say like this is probably one of the best accessories for anybody who has any of the iPhone 12s as well as a vehicle that they use daily. So very similar to the MagSafe charger. It has the clips that you attach to your car's vent. And then at the back, you will see this design, which is a MagSafe compatibility design. And it clips onto your iPhone 12 Pro really easily. And it makes a nice clicking noise like that. And your iPhone is able to stay on your car's mount without any issues. And it is compatible with the cases too, as long as you buy a case with the MagSafe ring. And it'll just clip on so it doesn't have any issues with the case as well. So that was pretty much it for the five accessories for the iPhone 12 um, that I highly recommend. I'll leave a link for all of these accessories. And to cap it off, I have number one is a silicone case, number two, the power adapter, number three, AirPods, number four, MagSafe charger, and finally number five, which is a car vent mount pro. Highly recommend these accessories for the iPhone 12 Pro and any of the other 12 series. I think these are gonna be absolutely amazing gifts for anybody who you know that has an iPhone 12. They will absolutely love every single one of these and these are actually gonna be really helpful for them in their day-to-day -day lives. Car is one of those that's dependent because if somebody doesn't have a car, then it doesn't make sense. But these four accessories, highly recommend it. And like I said, I'll leave a link for all of these accessories in the description as well as in the comment section. And once again, let me know what you thought about this video. Um, if you have any recommendations for accessories, leave them in the comment section down below. And once again, make sure you subscribe so you don't miss out on the future video that's coming for this phone, which is going to be the one month review and finally the full review for the iPhone 12 Pro Max. That's pretty much it for this video. Thank you very much for watching and I'll catch you in the next one. Goodbye.